The anti-anxiety medication we're flushing down the toilet could actually be increasing the lifespan of fish. So hopefully we all know by now that when you flush your medication down the toilet, it doesn't just disappear and get processed by your sewage treatment plant. It ends up flowing down river, goes into lakes, rivers, and these creatures in these bodies of water are the unwitting recipients of our pharmaceuticals that enter their ecosystem via sewage. And according to a new study, it is having unexpected consequences for a variety of creatures. So apparently drugs that are being prescribed to treat humans may actually be helping out fish as well. Researchers at a university in Sweden brought wild Eurasian perch from a local lake into the lab and exposed them to oxazepam, which is a benzodiazepine, which is used to treat anxiety in humans. It's also surface contaminating surface water in high concentrations. So what's fascinating is perch die pretty quickly. Only 8% of the fry actually make it to adulthood. But what's been interesting in this control group is that among newly hatched fry and two-year-old fish, when they're exposed to the drug, they stop dying completely. So when these animals are treated with this reaction, it's what, what happens is a paradoxical reaction. So when a human takes this drug, they have less anxiety, their nervous system calms down, it might make them go to sleep. But in these drugs, or in these fish, a paradoxical reaction happens where the perch are bolder, less social, and more hyperactive. That also leads them to eat more quickly, which has allowed them to stay alive much longer than their non-medicated counterparts. So it's easy to see that our medications, when you flush them down the toilet, are having unexpected and frankly paradoxical consequences in the ecosystems in which they're exposed to. So it's something to think about and something that you may not have thought of when you flush that prescription down the toilet when you're done with them. Let me know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe.